Willow uh, with Porsche Owners Club. It's counterclockwise today. I haven't been uh, this direction, so it's going to be a new track for me. So can't wait to get there, get started. So let's cut out all the talking and let's do some racing. I feel like I'm in the 24-hour Le Mans race with this, all this darkness and then it's going to turn to daytime later. It's funny. Let's go! We just hit 20,000 miles, guys! Check engine light. Guys, we stopped at our second gas station to get some gas. Probably about 20 bucks. We uh, spent about $64 the first time and we're averaging about 20 miles per gallon. A lot better than the Raptor. About twice as better. Twice as much as the Raptor. The sky's coming out. Looks pretty nice. Enjoying the views of Bakersfield. Nothing out here but a track. A little sunrise post. session is done check out these tires guys completely roasted so we're gonna tow the tires over to the, uh, the tire shop right now and that's how you do it All right guys, we're changing out the helmet visor. This is clear. We're going blue. Wow, look at that. We just gotta remove the HJC Motorsport, Porsche Motorsport, and we're good. Looks hard. It's gonna match the car over there. What's up guys, we're here, it's race day. There's gonna be a race going on right now. Uh, watching Jimmy Lormer, my stepdad, he's in a GT2, racing a 997.2 cup car. See how he does. I wanna show you guys my, my little mishap over here. So, 
I've been running really good. I had a really good session right now. I did a 207 compared to a 212. But uh, there seems to be a little bit of a mishap here. <laughs> Not too bad. I think it will buff out. Good thing this is a wrap, right guys? This will come out. Don't worry about that. But other than that, it's, it's running good. I'll show you guys the footage that of that, that little spin out right now. Um, what happened was I came out of the corner a little squirrely and then I touched the, the rear um, on the, the painted curb and that kind of like just completely let the car go and it stopped the car and I spun. So don't do that, Jonathan, on the next one. Don't do that. Very bad move. But as you can see, everything is still running. We ran really good. Got my Sparco Circuit 2. And the time trials, got my roll cage. As you can see, it's nice and bright out. Usually this thing is in the garage. But super fun day, Got did the tire swap. Uh, ran uh, my first practice session with the crappy tires and change out the fronts. The rears are still good, so I should be one more session or two and you know, be back.
Hey guys, hope you enjoyed this footage of the track and the racing a little bit on the onboard. Um, yeah, Jimmy Lormer, uh, my stepdad did really well. He was up to like first, I believe, and then he went off a little bit, lost his lip, but uh, it was such good racing. Uh, good job, you know, Jimmy and everyone out there racing together. Uh, made it for a cool show to watch. Um, yeah, and, and just to circle back with my car, everything is good. Uh, we're back home, everything is safe. And uh, we're, we're here, we're quarantined for a while. It's probably a good thing because uh, I have to deal with some, some damage. Uh-oh. So what I'm thinking of doing is um, this will buff out and all that for the tail light. But then also for the wrap, we can rewrap this bumper piece. Um, maybe go back to white or maybe blue for just this section here. But, it, you know, it's kind of messed up there as well. So not, it's not really that terrible. You know, there's no dents or dings or anything like that. It's just scuffed up a little bit. But thankfully, um, you know, there's a wrap on the car and you know, I highly recommend it if you track a car, get the clear bra or the wrap. But nonetheless, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that footage. I got a 207, my buddy got a 205, so still I'm still slower, I gotta work on that, but it was a super fun day. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, let me know what you thought about the vlog, and uh, got some more footage coming up soon, hopefully, uh, with this virus going out, uh, locking everything down, closing everything up, so I don't know when the Porsche Owners Club is, but stay tuned, I'll keep you guys updated, and uh, stay golden, everybody.